Hi, I've made this little video tour so you can see and hear how these worksheets work and how this FAJ financing works. In this scenario, to keep your cash down, I am suggesting that you negotiate with the seller to pay $10,500 toward closing. The purchase detail would be a sales price of $235, 3.5% down. Your loan would be $226. But FHA has an upfront premium, MIP, mortgage insurance premium, equal to 1.75% of the loan. So we roll that into the loan. You can pay it in cash, but we're going to roll it into the loan. So our loan will actually be $237.44. The monthly payment is based on the rate of three and a quarter. It's a 360 month or 30 year loan. We're guessing the taxes are $6,000. We're guessing that you'll find insurance for about $900 and then there's mortgage insurance. So the payment, the principal and interest, the amount to repay the loan is $1,004, plus you pay one twelfth of the tax, one twelfth of the insurance, and the monthly mortgage insurance, so you have a total payment of $1,742.65. Cash to close. The cash to close is almost $19,000. It's your down payment, plus your closing costs, which are itemized below, plus the prepaid expenses, again itemized below, totaling 18800 or nearly that. But because the seller is going to be asked to pay 10500 which you'll negotiate, you would need 8279 And uh, if you get a $1,000 deposit, you paid for a home inspection, paid for an appraisal, the total that you would need at closing is 6779 So you really owe the full amount of 8200 but you give a deposit, you pay for your home inspection, you pay for your appraisal, and balances due at closing. Now see how I said up here to, the itemization would be below? This is everything. Now we're just going to look at the itemization. The closing costs are itemized in this section. Appraisal, credit report, transfer tax, lender's title insurance, origination fee, flood cert, owner's title, recording, attorney, home inspection. So all that came up to here. Prepaid expenses are basically taxes, insurance, and interest. So we I guess that you need about seven months taxes up front um, to establish a escrow account and to reimburse the seller for any taxes he may have paid in advance. Uh, this is not a loan estimate, so we don't want to um, confuse this. This is just strictly for informational purposes. Hope you find this information helpful.